Okay, welcome back. So today I'm gonna to show you where you can find your own gold. And if you're a new gold panner, I'll show you where we can find some bigger gold, right inside the city of Edmonton. So I'm just walking down to the park. I just got to the parking lot. And we're gonna do a couple hours of panning. Let's go see what we can find. Okay, I'm down at the creek now. Just gonna walk upstream a little bit and do some test pans there. I already know there's gold down here. Gold in all of this gravel. It's an inside corner. But let's move upstream. So it's time to cross into New Pan. My last one floated away on this river during flood season. Brand new Garrett Super Sluice. Woohoo! Okay, so as I was walking up the river, I noticed something here. And I think this is where I'm going to do a couple test pans. Let me show you what I'm seeing. Now, can you see all these brown rocks? I think that they're ironstone. They're pretty heavy. Nice little accumulation right at the head of a inside corner here. So the water is coming around. These rocks are heavy. Water's changing course. Heavy stuff are dropping out. Let's see if we can find some gold. So the first pan, when you get a brand new pan, you wanna you wanna season her up. I'll do that with my first pan. Let's nice accumulation right here. I'm gonna go in for some material right down here.
Time to pan it out. I'm just going to move a couple of rocks, make myself a little pool to pan in. No, I don't classify. Shake it up really good. Make sure everything gets washed in that pan. Now all that stuff floating off the top, that's just the clay. That's the light stuff floating away. Keep going until there's no more of that. Dirtier the better. So as I'm shaking it up, I'm tilting forward, getting that gold trapped up in those uh, giant riffles. Oh, it feels good to have the Garrett Super Sluice back in my hand. Okay, let's check that pan out. Any gold? Can you see it? One little dot. Lots of little dots, but one. Okay, four test pans in. I think I found the spot. So I did one test pan. You can see them all. There's at least a hundred good sized pieces. They're tiny, but it's a good count now. Let's try again. I'll dump these out into this pan. Okay. 
No gold, brand new pan. That was from one shovel right there. Now, let me show you why I chose this spot. So, as you can see, we're on a huge inside corner. It's like an S-bend. But, we're right at the head of the S-bend. There's bigger rocks dropping out. And it might be a little hard to tell, but there's this little slough. Where the gravel's flat, and then it goes up. So what I've done is where that section, flat section goes up, it starts to come around a corner, which is right here. I did one little shovel full. Now I'm going to fill the pan and see what we can get. Let's see if I can do this. So, this is one pan, unclassified. Wow, gold bar. I'm gonna get it all panned into one spot and I'll show you. I panned it down to nothing but gold. Check this out, one pan. Okay, there it is. Okay, next pan. Pieces are getting bigger. Fifth pan from the spot. There we go. I did 10 pans. Got myself a nice garnet. A little bit of gold. 